Hey everyone, just want to do a quick example of the first translation theorem. So say we have the Laplace transform of, I don't know, e to the 2t times cosine of 3t. So this is actually extremely easy. So whenever you have an e to a number times t in front of a function, what you do is you drop the e and you replace it with a shift. So this is cosine of 3t, and then you just replace this with a shift. So this is a shift, so you draw a line, from s to s minus 2. So if it was like e to the 3t, the shift would be s to s minus 3. It's always s minus this number. So if it was negative 3t, it'd be s to s plus 3, right? So it's the opposite. Okay, so just s minus this number. Okay, now we have to find the Laplace of this thing here. Well, if you recall, the Laplace transform of cosine kt just remember, cosine has the s, so it has an s. That's how, that's how I memorize it. So cosine has the s, and then it's s squared plus k squared. If it's sine, you have a k up here. All right, so here it's going to be s over um, s squared plus, and then your k is your 3 here, so it's 3 squared. And then we still have the shift, s to s minus 2. Then you just replace all of the s's with s minus 2's. So this is s minus 2 and then s minus 2 squared plus 3 squared. Then you just simplify the 3, so it would be s minus 2 over s minus 2 squared plus 9. That was super quick, but um, just wanted to make a really quick video to show you. That's it.